Where did the inspiration for this film come from? Um, I just when I started thinking about westerns um, and reading about the history of the West being full of sort of and, and traveling around America and people saying, oh, I was from Scotland, my parents were from Ireland, Scandinavia, Germany, and thinking that hadn't really been explored in a Western film before. So I thought taking it from a really, a Western full of European characters was the, the start. Very cool. And you obviously didn't shoot it in the West because the West doesn't look like you want it to look right <laughs> now. That's true. That's very true. Yeah. I, I think there's still a lot of Colorado probably does, but it's just so vast and it would just be so hard to shoot um, a movie there that goes through a lot of different kind of plains, desert, trees, hills, mountains. You'd have to do a lot of traveling to, whereas New Zealand, they're all Within about, yeah, it's so compact, yeah, so. Yeah. so that was the... What's, what's your favorite Western? If you can pick one, I mean, it's, it's I mean, I would say, I'd say it's probably Once Upon a Time in the West is, okay. is the, and, and then my favorite Western, non-Western would be McCabe and Mrs. Miller, you know, but classic, yeah, I, but I, have to say, I, I, I love so many Westerns, actually. Do you, do you pull any hints of those or anything really specific that you wanted to I think there's nods to, I mean, there's nods to McCabe and Mrs. Miller in this and um, and Shane and a few other Westerns, you know. But, um, there's also nods to other genres of, of films as well, Japanese cinema and all, all sorts of, and European cinema. So I tried to keep it not, I didn't want to make a sort of Western influenced by, influenced by Westerns right. kind of film. So, right. yeah. And what, what, what inspired you to jump on board? What was... What was the uh, main um, thing? That well, just I just always when reading a script, it's obviously you're just looking for something you like and you want to put yourself in and express, but also have an audience um, want to receive it and, and, and take it as well. And this was definitely one of those. As I read it, it just kind of felt like an amazing book I was reading, the yeah. adventures and, and the emotions that it goes through. Um, and then obviously when I started Skyping John, I saw that he was on the same page that I saw the character. Yeah. And then from there, it just took on.